everyone welcome to day four of vlogmas so in today's video i'm kind of getting the hang of doing these daily vlogs there's a lot of people that do these professional every single day and i just don't know how they do it anyways in today's vlog i'm going to be doing a little bit of a try on haul so it's going to be kind of like a casual wear and then i'm going to show you how to style some pieces i got these i have a lot of pieces from um aritzia um, a lot of them are like vegan leather and then some of them are polyester but I will show you how I style that as well as some casual pieces as well from I think my H&M order should be in today if not I'm just going to use some of the pieces that came in from some of the um, Black Friday sales that was some of them came really fast um Dayton is digging too I don't know Dayton Dayton. That's why I can't have nice things. He's just ripping up everything. Dayton. Dayton, what are you looking for? Dayton. Dayton. Look. Treats. Treats. You're so silly. So as you guys can see... It is snowing out. It's supposed to snow for like the next couple days. It's really pretty. That's our little shed back there and some evergreens and it's... Oh my god. Just finished crying because I took the dog for a walk and I know he's only eight months old and um, this is his first winter and he is horrible when he's excited and he was jumping up and he doesn't bite but when he's outside he tries to go after your mitts he doesn't understand that, that your fingers are in there and he he bites and he jumps and at one point he had me on the ground like I had to drop to my knees and he had me spinning because he just jumps and grabs your mitts and he wants to play and he runs and he runs and he does not stop and you try to offer him treats you try to hold him down and it's just he doesn't have a muzzle he has a like a harness or a halty that goes around his mouth and you try to hold him down and he also has a harness and we double leash him just because he's 60 pounds and he's just he's also muscle and he just it was horrible like usually I go and I walk him with somebody else and he's pretty good but because it's snowing outside and again it's like his first walk and he's covered like he's just so wet because he was so excited and I feel bad but I had this woman had to walk in front of me like thank god she came and she did because he snapped out of it because he loves people and he wanted to follow her and we followed her up the hill to the house um we just stayed in our neighborhood and i'm i'm not going to take them alone again because that was just ridiculous so i went on amazon and i ordered a no pull harness and a muzzle and i've never had to order a dog a muzzle and it's not because he's aggressive it's because he's so excited and he hasn't had his surgery yet to snip snip and that's scheduled in January and they, they're all backed up because of the pandemic and everything so we can't get him in earlier so he's just it's a lot and when you have 60 pounds and they're running and they're spinning you and you're just trying for your life to hold them down so that they don't back out of the harness that he was wearing and he backs onto the street because that was my worst fear is that he's going to snap the harness because he's going to think it's a game and he's going to run into the middle of the street and get run over by a car and it's just you try to give him a stick, you try to give him treats, you try to give him your glove, and he doesn't stop, and it was just, it was really scary, and I gotta exercise him, I think, a little bit more before we go on walks. But like I said, it was snowing, it's his first winter, it's only the second time he's seen snow, and that was the first time he was walking during snow, and it just got him so excited, but um, yeah, I'm gonna go eat lunch now, and <laughs> maybe have a couple glasses of wine. No, I'm not gonna do that, it's like midday. All right, I will see you guys later after lunch. Hi everyone, welcome to my little mini try on haul and style session. So I have a couple pieces here I'm going to show you. Some of them I'm going to show you by popping um, some pieces on the screen and then other pieces I will show you how uh, I style them, how I'm wearing them. It's going to be like a really quick little mini haul. The first up is this sweater. <laughs> Absolutely love this sweater. It's really nice. Um, it is all sequins. It's got this little balloon detailing at the sleeve. Now um, we'll get back to this later. But first up, I want to get started with something that's really comfortable. So I actually have a set, and it is a knitted set. 
and it is like a knitted set the ones that you see at Zara this one's probably really inexpensive it comes in white black and beige I have the beige set I might get the black set this is a really nice thick quality so I style this with the um, matching knit pants first I'm gonna throw up a picture really quickly of what the outfit looks like all together so that's how the model is wearing I didn't show you the bottom of the pants but the pants are really thick and comfortable to wear they have a really nice stretch to them and it has this really nice thick band on it so it's super comfortable to wear I'm just really impressed it also comes with a skirt so this is what the skirt looks like I also have the skirt here um, so knee length it's a little bit thinner it does have a high slit on the side so I just have that whole little set now we're gonna stick with the set themes except this one's gonna be a lot more dressy and in tweed <laughs> you guys know I can't resist tweed so first up is this tweed skirt it is a mini skirt it is black with black sequins in it super thick and good material like it's a little bit tight um, if you're somebody who's like in between a small medium or a medium large size up one so anyways like I said this was a set so it came with this beautiful blazer like guys when you see this blazer you're gonna lose your mind this is a double breasted sequence tweed blazer that matches it so it's a matching set super cute you can also wear them um, obviously as separates but the buttons on these guys like the buttons have little jewels in them like how cute is that I was just like wasn't expecting that detail wasn't expecting to have shoulder pads or be thick or be that great quality but like I I don't know I think this is just such a cute outfit I would wear this all the time um even though it does have sequins in it sometimes sequins can be itchy I didn't find that with this um the inside of everything is lined so you're not going to get that scratchy itchy feeling that you might get when you do have a sequence and tweed together and then sticking with the theme of sparkle um my shirt or sweater also comes in a v-neck a deep deep v-neck <laughs> bodysuit with an open back I will show you how I styled it. I do have the bodysuit right here. So it does have nice balloon sleeves and kind of a little bit of a shoulder pad. In the front and in the back, you kind of have this nice big deep V. Definitely wear something under this or use some tape. I didn't have any tape and I used the wrong route when I was modeling this. I'll show you what I styled it with. <laughs> So this is what it looks like here. It's super pretty on, really comfortable. Again, it is lined really nicely. So even though it is sequenced, it's not scratchy or cheap feeling. It's just such a really beautiful piece, especially if you want to, you know, just go from your living room on New Year's Eve. <laughs> and then I have one more outfit to show you guys. And this is probably my favorite outfit because again, it is comfy meets style. So, so this is a knitted cream hoodie which again, I did not get any makeup on or lipstick trying to get this over my head. Um, I think I have the, I'm um, sorry, segue. I have the Revlon Stay All Day Super Red Lipstick thing. I'll link that below. Anyways, this is a big, thick crew neck knitted cream hoodie. I'll pop the picture of what it looks like on here. Again, super comfortable. It comes in black. It has a dropped sleeve everything's knitted it's really just so comfortable and cozy to wear and it feels so nice and it's nice where it's not overly baggy so up here it's still giving you some shape and then you can kind of tuck in the bottom if you want to style it i styled it with um these pants and these pants guys i'm living for these pants these are the aritzia melena melina pants so they come in cream burgundy green um, black they come in a whole bunch of colors so these are a V like an actual vegan leather from Japan they're not polyester they are from Aritzia and they're definitely worth the price these are like a nice form fitted pants and then they shape your butt really good like if you want to have a nice butt and they're not tight right so they flare out at the ends and I'll just pop a picture right here so again I styled it with the cream shirt that I just showed you but guys you're gonna invest in a pair of vegan leather or leather pants. These pants are so beautiful. They give you a nice shape to your bum. They're not super tight. Um, they kind of flare up beautifully at the knee. I absolutely love them. I'm not gonna show you what they look like. I did not 
film a full length <laughs> me wearing these pants because guys I'm not even wearing shoes and half the try-ons like we all know fashion videos are not my cup of tea I need to kind of figure out space and how to properly shoot them but um anyway I tried so I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini haul everything will be linked below if you are interested from makeup to outfits to um the dog harness and muzzle that I ordered for the dog because today was a day anyways i'm gonna stop talking your faces off and i will see you guys tomorrow for the next day of vlogmas videos bye guys bye.